The game that we are playing today is called Fraction Reaction. In this game, we will be looking to create fraction card pairs that represent equivalent fractions using cards that have different visual representations. We will be using numerical fraction cards and circle area model fraction cards. The object of the game is to find the largest number of pairs of cards that represent the same fraction. Shuffle all the cards together and deal four cards to each player. The youngest player starts. On your turn, match any pairs in your hand. If you do not have a pair, you must pass. If you do have a pair, lay the cards down and state the fraction in a number sentence. For example, 4 eighths equals 1 half. You may play as many pairs as you can during each turn. At the end of your turn, replace cards in your hand using cards from the center so that you have four cards at all times. Your turn ends. Play moves to the left. Once all the cards have been matched, players count the pairs they have made. The player with the most cards is the winner. This game can lead to critical math understanding and fractions. Here are possible questions to ask players. Sample answers are provided that demonstrate understanding of equivalent fractions. How did you know that these were equal fractions? I let two of the eight pieces represent one chunk. When I looked at it like this, I could see that there was one chunk shaded and there were four chunks total. Therefore, I saw that two eighths was equal to one fourth. What did you find challenging about this game? I found it challenging to remember what the numerical fractions looked like visually, such as one half equals four eighths, which also equals two fourths. All four of these are equivalent.